Hey guys, another trio of tickets, plus one for you, making four. We've got the triple sevens, which we just had a winner in our last video. And we have two frosty crosswords, one of which is for our viewers to solve, which I think this left one has a little better start. So I'm going to save that one for you guys. We're going to solve this one together, hopefully bring a win, and then... Uh, you guys will solve the second one and you can post the winning words in the comment section there. We'll see how well you do and uh, hopefully we get a nice winner. Okay. We've got several ends, meaning three, which is more than more than we usually get. We are filming tonight from Bullhead City, Arizona. Sleepy little town on the very northern end of uh, Arizona that meets Nevada at the Colorado River. All right, the letter F. A lot of uh, snowbirds come here from the north to get away from the uh, the cold and the snow in the winter. This is really a uh, kind of a senior place in the uh, winter. Okay, one V. Let's see what happens with the C. Boy, I'm looking, looking, looking. Are you trying to tell me there's no C? Not a single C. We hate to get a blank so early. All right. No blank here. A couple of L's right away. Okay, not bad. Whoops, I missed a missed the edge one there. All right, the letter K for ski should be an easy one to spell. Three digits. I want to take just a second to thank uh, all of our new subscription people. Seems like the more videos we post, the more subscribers we get, which is what we're after. We can see the day soon, and we'll be up to a thousand. All right, the letter J. I am looking for, I don't see, and well, you guys always know we miss one once in a while, but we try and catch up. Anyways, big thanks. Big thanks to all you guys that spend that extra minute and, and share one of our uh, videos on your your Facebook page. We know that takes a couple of minutes, takes some time, but uh, it really adds up for us in the end. It keeps us in lottery tickets, and uh, we sincerely appreciate it. All right, this ticket developed nicely with that A. Now we have an O. We have an O, but not such a not such a big sighting of O's here. Hmm, just no, there is a third O. Okay, good good deal. That's that's a little better. All right, the letter D. We have a couple of tickets that uh, you guys, the audience, have solved and uh, have become paydays in our prior videos. All right, H for helium. I don't think I've ever seen that word on a ticket before. We're going to need to finish fast here because this ticket needs help. Maybe we can squeak out a couple of these little words. All right, we did spell bulb. Baby's got a chance with a Y. We do have two letters left, but boy, we don't have an I or an E yet. Pretty tough. An R or an S is missing. And I can tell that's a Z because I scratched it a little early. And the G I missed for Gypsy did not miss a Y, so I'm not even sure if we can spell another word here, guys. I think it's going to be up to you guys on the last ticket to bring us a winner here. Yeah, a few I's, but they're not completing any words. 
Uh, no S, no R, no E. I think this is going in the bummer pile. But this is the one I've got saved for you guys. Now I've got a couple of triple uh, sevens to scratch after this one. So we are going to uh, let you guys gaze upon the puzzle. As you can see, we've started a little bit of it. And I am going to expose the letters for you. We'll give you a good look at those letters. I know some of you guys like to write them down and uh, the four letters we started with, of course, one of them was an A, which helped the ticket along, and uh, the L also. So here is your puzzle. I'll let you see both sides, just so there's no question. And you guys get a good look at that, and we will get on to our triple sevens, and we'll bring this back for another uh, ten seconds at the end of the video. So that'll give you guys something to get started on. We can scratch these triple seven tickets pretty quickly. If you haven't seen them in our other videos, pretty simple. We're only looking for a seven. And we'd rather see a seven in the first, po uh, first column for the simple fact because that would possibly be a triple. But our last win was all the way down in the right hand corner and it was a single seven which was worth five dollars. So not bad on a a two dollar ticket. All right, no sevens here. Come on, seven. Show your ugly head here. Boy, every number but a seven. All right, that first one is no good. Goes in the discards. But we have one more. So we will say the best lucky prayer we know. All right, no sevens, not going to be a triple winner. However, we'll go for a single $25 bill if we can find it. Nothing in the second column. Hard to imagine all these numbers and not a seven in sight. Okay, <laughs> another one. They go quick, though. All right, back to your ticket, viewers. We will let you guys... Figure them out and post the words for all to, all to see in the uh, comments. And uh, we've got some more of these. We're going to let you solve some more. And uh, keep looking as we've got uh, several videos to go. Thanks, guys. Nevada Arcade out.